Hey guys, what's up? It is baking time this time, and we're gonna do a cookie in a mug. It's pretty much like a warm cookie in the mug, and it's like really good, personally, I think. And later we're gonna put some toppings on it. And let's get started. So the first thing is we're gonna add melted butter. Make sure to get it all in there. Oh no, my hands are all greasy now because I got it on my hand. <laughs> so, then we're going to do some sugar. And I'm doubling the recipe. So, because I'm making one for my brother too. I'm going to add light brown sugar. Personally, I think this feels like kinetic sand. And I think kinetic sand feels pretty nice. So then we're going to measure this out to be two teaspoons of vanilla extract. One, two. It smells so good. My favorite flavor of ice cream is vanilla. I know, very plain, but I like it. So now we're gonna take the flour. Well, now I'm ready to bake. So we're just gonna dump that all in. And then we're gonna do the eggs. We have one egg here. It's a really funny noise, it like jiggles inside. Let's just crack that open and put it all in there. Such a mustard baker chef. So then we are going to add some baking powder, not so powder. So we're just gonna flip that in there. And then we're gonna do chocolate chips. I love chocolate chips. I like them cold. Just gonna dump those in. Whoa, there's more. <laughs> so I'm just gonna mix this all up. It's looking so good. You might not feel like it's dough. That's how it's supposed to be, because you're not making like a real cookie, but you kind of are, so yes. So I think this is mixed pretty well. I'm just gonna take the piggy spoon. It is a spoon with a pig. <laughs> Let's just put this all in there. <laughs> that went everywhere. <laughs> Just put that in. I'm going to make sure I get all the butter chunks smashed up. Because I don't want any butter chunks in my cookie. That would not taste very delicious. Ooh, that tastes so good. This is looking pretty good. So I'm just gonna take it off of the spatula and put some in here. So let's try and get some of it out in here. So let's put this all up in here. Let's see, is that good for now? I'm gonna put the rest in after, but I think this one needs a little more. Put this all in there. Okay, now that it's all even, we microwave it to one to two minutes. And after that, you get to decorate, which I think is the funnest part. And I'll check back in with you when it's done. <laughs> These smell so good. So we need to check them with a toothpick to make sure they're fully baked through. So we just put them in the microwave. And I'd say that's pretty big. It is decorating time. We have some whipped cream, colorful rainbow sprinkles, some chocolate sprinkles. We have blue sprinkles. These are my favorite because they're really crunchy. 
And then we have some purple sprinkles. So we're just gonna put some whipped cream on. And you just need to... <laughs> Well, I'm gonna add some blue sprinkles to mine because these are my favorite. Some to my brothers. Put some purple sprinkles in mine. Some rainbow sprinkles and some chocolate sprinkles. And now they're ready to eat. That is the best thing I've ever put in my mouth. It's so good. If you want, you could try this out at your house. I think this tastes like so good, so you should really try it. So like and subscribe, and comment down below if you tried this out. Peace.